Hey guys, it's Sarah. Um, doing a haul video for you today. This is a combination haul of um, Amazon. It is Menards, which I will never, ever go to buy supplies at again. And um, Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby. So I've got quite a bit to show you today. So let's get into it. The first thing I bought was this AdTech 10 inch glue sticks. Um, they're multi temp for a full size glue gun, five pounds. I go through so much hot glue that I felt like I really needed to just invest in a large size, and I went ahead and bought the bulk pack. All right, for Menards, I just picked up a few things. I picked up some wood screws for my upcoming lantern project, which will be premiering. It's a collaboration with some other girls on YouTube. Um, I picked up two different sizes of painter's tape and I go through a lot of this just in general crafting and so can never have too much of this. The other two things I bought was a 10 inch by 12 foot board um, and that is for the lantern project part of it as well and I also bought a baluster. This trip took us about 45 minutes at Menards, I kid you not. Um, we got the board, we asked where to go get it cut down so that it would fit in our car. We simply needed it cut in half. The uh, lady we finally found in the Christmas section told us to take it up front, which we did, and the gentleman that helped us back in the contractor section at the front of the store dropped the F-bomb a couple times, just sounded really perturbed we were even there bothering him. And when we got up front, neither the baluster nor the wood had any pricing on it. And it took us forever to get what we needed, get out of the store, and they left us feeling like we were just bothering them by even being in their business. So we decided we won't be anymore. Unfortunately, um, that was the worst experience I've had in a long time. But now, moving on to better things. At Dollar Tree... I just bought some of these Jot sheet protectors, and these are just great because they, they're basically non-stick for um, different things, for paint, peels right off of it, acrylic paint peels right off of it, um, different things like that. So these are actually being used not as sheet protectors, but just because they're a good thing to put down um, to protect your work surfaces. Picked up some more of their scouring pads. We go through these a lot. I use them all the time. And for the price, 12 or 10 for a dollar, you can't really beat it. I found these adorable clear um, stickers, and I thought these were great for Christmas. They're ornaments. So I went ahead and picked these up. I picked up a couple set of these salad tongs, and these will be great um, for Christmas gifts um, once they're embellished. Picked up a couple set of these um, candy cane Christmas ornaments. Okay. I picked up a couple more of these cookie pans. Um, I had mentioned before in another video, I use these a lot um, up in the craft room when I'm moving things around, trying to work on different uh, projects. So I picked up a couple more of these because the 50 Christmas crafts, things are getting kind of crazy in here. They were getting in a lot of Buffalo Check Christmas items, so I picked up this Deck the Halls Buffalo Check um, Travel Cup. I use these all the time because I am a super klutz and I'm always spilling glasses. And for a dollar, you really can't go wrong. So I went ahead and grabbed one of these. It was so cute. Picked up some Jingle Bells. I picked up this uh, decorated bell, and it's not actually a bell that rings. It's just decoration. All right, I picked up this sparkly burlap bow. I thought that was really cute. I picked up a couple more strands of their 15-foot garland. It's There's not a lot to it. It's pretty thin and sparse, but um, if you string a couple of them together, you're still getting a great deal because you can't buy the thicker garland for two, three dollars for a 15-foot strand. I grabbed this tinsel Christmas tree not so much because I like the tinsel on it. I'm planning on taking the tinsel and the decorations off, um, completely deconstructing it, and just using the plastic form on the back to make a different tree decoration. 
I picked up three of their little mini birdhouses and they have these back in their crafters section. We picked up three of these LED window candles and I'm going to put these in our front windows this year. They have the suction cups so they attach directly to the window and for a dollar a piece they can't be beat. For example, this set here at Hobby Lobby, even at 50% off, is a lot more money um, than you would spend for the... I picked up just one of these faux wood chargers. I thought these were absolutely gorgeous. Um, I had thought about picking up more for our Christmas table. I may go back and get some more, but for now I am using it just for one of my upcoming Christmas projects. I picked up two of these wreaths that they have, and these are a different kind of wreath than they've carried in the past. These are almost like a split, um, I don't know how to describe it, the wood is almost like a split wood. It's different than just the, the wrapped one they had before, so I thought these were neat. thought I'd give these a try. I picked up two different sizes of these um, wrapped twig decorations. And of course some snowflakes because you can never have too many snowflakes going into the holidays. And last but not least, I picked up these mini glass containers. And these were going to be a fun project coming up as well. Alright, now we are off to Hobby Lobby. And we picked up this set of four um, antler decorations. We picked up two packs of these cotton scatters and these were half off so we only paid $2.50 for each of these and you guys know how expensive these things can get so this was an excellent find. I picked up three different ribbons. I absolutely loved this one. It's got such a woodsy wintry feel to it. I don't know if you can really see it up close there um, but I absolutely love this. I've got a few things in mind for this one. It was $7.99, but all the Christmas stuff, all the fall stuff I'm showing you was half off. As a matter of fact, almost everything in these bags were half off today. I also picked up this muted gold. It's a wired edged mesh ribbon, and I thought this was pretty, really pretty. And this will be in one of my upcoming um, Coastal Christmas videos. And I picked up this burlap ribbon. I like the fact that both of the edges are finished and I know you can pick up ribbon at Dollar Tree for a buck, but you don't get these nice finished edges on it. So theirs tends to unravel. So again, um, $5.99, it was $3 for this huge roll. It's a 15 foot roll. So I thought that was a really good deal as well. And in case you can't tell by my hauls recently, a lot of my projects are going to lead toward um, the rustic, the woodland um, type Christmas theme this year. Picked up this wood Christmas tree. Um, I may have done one, picked one up in an earlier haul. I had already filmed the video for the project that I was going to use this tree on. Somehow I lost every bit of footage I filmed. So we're starting over from the very beginning. I bought another one of these trees and it's a really cute project so I'm really looking forward to it and I hope you guys like it as much as I do. And I picked up some more chenille stems. These were um, four bucks. They were half off so a really good deal. And these are colors that I will be able to use um, pretty much year round but the darker colors blend really well with um, some of the country projects that I'll be doing and it's got the red and green as well so this will come in real handy right now. Picked up a 16 ounce black acrylic paint. Um, one of my projects is going to use a lot of paint and I thought this was um, $4.99 and with the 40% off coupon a really good deal. Cheaper than I would get if I went to buy some in um, the paint store. I found this it's a really cute, it's a buffalo check apron, and I will be wearing this in some of my upcoming videos. Um, I tend to get really messy when I craft, and since I promised the girls that I'm going to be in that lantern collab with that I would show my face, starting that video I'll be showing my face, but I will be wearing the apron, otherwise I will ruin my clothing. And I found these adorable little Christmas elves, and these were with the mini Christmas 
ornaments up in that front section at Hobby Lobby. I absolutely adore elves, so I had to get these. I picked up a new craft knife um, and saw blade to go with it. I grabbed a couple of these little paper mache flower pots. Um, originally, my plan was to go get a couple small terracotta plants, but or terracotta pots, but these aren't any more expensive and they're, they won't break. So I opted for these instead. Grabbed some tri triple thick. Um, I'm almost out of what I had. So again, um, it was $6.99, but we used a coupon on it. So that came out at a really good deal. One wooden embroidery hoop. You'll see this coming up sometime soon. Candles. So this was a really great buy. All right, I picked up um, a set of these wood finials as well as some of these doll caps. I picked up some of these armored starfish and these are for my coastal Christmas video. And I picked up the this set of little coastal charms. It's called Pirate Charm Set as well as, and Eric found these for me, these little um, bracelet findings. And these, of course, are also going to be part of the Coastal Christmas video. I found these little mini um, deer antler Christmas ornaments and some little Christmas charms. It's just a little variety pack of all sorts of little different Christmas charms in them. And so I thought these were adorable and some rusted bells and these were $6.99 but again these were half off as well. The last thing I picked up were these styrofoam balls. They were $4 regular and they were half off and you need to watch. Um, when I went, I originally went back to the department, General Crafts picked up some styrofoam balls were not on sale. I noticed these in the Christmas department same size balls on sale half off. So be sure you watch the, the holiday sections when you're going in to pick up some general crafts because some of that stuff, just the difference that it makes is the tag on the top and you can save 50%. And that is it. That is what I have for today. And I'm really excited to get busy, start using some of this stuff. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another video. Bye-bye. If you like this video, please be sure to hit that like button as well as share it with friends who may also enjoy it. If you like my channel, hit that subscribe button and when the notification bell pops up, be sure you hit that as well so you never miss a video. And as always, have a great day and stay crafty.